Washington State Department of Transportation did an inspection of this bridge here last month. They noticed some structural problems with it, so now they're deciding to close that bridge starting today at 8 a.m. Take a look at these pictures here. These are photos of some of the damage that WashDOT noticed when they did that inspection. They say they're concerned about the hinges on either side of the bridge, plus the actual bridge surface that people walk and bike on is cracked in some places. WashDOT is putting together an emergency contract to start tearing the bridge down. Then they'll set a date to full demolish the bridge. In the meantime, here's a look at the ways to get around the closure. Walkers and bikers can cross the freeway using Altamont just east of the bridge, or you can head, head west of the bridge and cross under near Liberty Park. Now, this bridge has been here since 1969, over 50 years. Over the decades, Washout has been doing repairs on it, uh, but the original plan was for them to replace this bridge later this decade during the north-south freeway construction. In Spokane, Nicole Hernandez, Crumb 2 News.